What's up, y'all? It's training day. I got my boy Gooch Bo behind the camera, aka Boss Man D. Today is training day. I want to show you what's going on. Come take a, take a look at these numbers. You see what that says? 62 million. Take a few. 16,682. That's in the last 28 days. 500,000 followers. And look at it in the last 28 days, I got 25,000 new followers. So I'm gonna tell you, how I did it. you don't know how I did it? I'm gonna get straight to the kind. I can sugarcoat it, I can tell you straight what it is. Straight what it is, consistency. Post, 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 post. I'm talking about four, five posts a day. Reels, that is. I just found a new hack, but um, that's neither here nor there. I'm gonna get straight into it. We about to, uh, I'm about to take y'all on a day with me. Me and my boy, Boss Man, we about to ride through the city. And um, yeah, I'm gonna just show y'all what we on, man. As y'all can see, we out here in Minnesota. It's damn snow. I just left Dubai, man. Now I'm heated. I'm heated now that I gotta come back to this. We on our way, cruising down Lake Street. What happened? Old school? From the WOC. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We just cruising down Lake Street, man. Um, on our way to go grab some fire food for my homegirl. It's my old high school, you know what I'm saying? We're some bad kids, so we had to go to an alternative school. You know what I'm saying? We was in a public school at once upon a time. But then after the public school, I had to go to alternative school. You know, easy credits, man. They turned them into, um, like, rocks, condos. Yep. Condos or something like that. Yep, they done turned them cribs into condos. I mean, in, uh, the school into a condo. But it was alternative school. Super easy credits, man. All you had to do is read one book. You get a credit. <laughs> Graduation. <laughs> right, right. Yes, sir. We on our way. Oh, yeah, like I said, we on our way. We on the south side of Minneapolis right now. You know, we from Minnesota. So, um, you know, that's where we was born at. Born and raised. Well, I don't know. You was born here, right, Gooch? Yeah, man. Born and raised, man. We was born and raised. This is where we this is where we from. I actually wasn't born here. From Some the, funny stuff, but I was raised here, man. I've been here my whole life. We're from the we're from the dirt ass, dirt ass. Dirt ass, dirt ass. Mississippi, how about that? Yep, so we just riding down, um, about to go grab some food real quick, and uh, it's pretty much training day, man. I'm about to teach Gooch about how I got to all these followers, man. My boy on his YouTube wave, you know ain't boss man D. I know I said it already, but I'm gonna say it again until y'all get it. Boss man D, I'll put it on the screen be below. Y'all make sure y'all go subscribe to my boy channel. But yeah, man, I've been uh, you know, like I showed y'all in the beginning, I got 500k plus I got like 500 550,000 um YouTube, not YouTube, Facebook followers. God damn. But now I'm about to get back on YouTube. I'm about to show y'all how to get it on YouTube because it's the same thing pretty much. I just put more of my attention and more of my content on Facebook, which um I'm about to put it on YouTube, you know what I mean? I'm, I'm, I'm about to show y'all how I get down, y'all. YouTube, y'all about to get more of me. Steph Weezy, one of the ones. But yeah, we on our way to go grab some food. And um, yeah, it's training day, man. I'm going to teach y'all as well as teaching him how to get all them followers. Yes, but sir, yes, sir. to keep it real simple and save y'all some time if y'all want to watch the whole video, just be consistent. Just put in the work. You know what I'm saying? You ain't going to know what to do. You ain't going to know how to do it, but you do got to do it. That's one thing that I do know. You know, you once you start putting things in motion, things happen. That's what I learned about this game. And I've been doing videos for years now. You know what I mean? Right, right. I've been consistent, consistent, putting out content after content, video after video. And now it's, it's a whole career for me. You know what I'm saying? This is this is my way of life. This is how I make money. Well, not my way of life, but this is how I make my money now. You know what I mean? This is this is uh, taking care of all the things I need. My car, my house, you know what I'm saying? My bills, everything through social media with posting content. And y'all can do it too. All y'all got to do is post like me. All y'all got to do is grab your camera. You don't even need a camera. Grab your iPhone if you got an iPhone and hit record and then you learn these 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 editing apps i'm gonna tell y'all more about that later on but simple man you can edit all through your phone you can post all through your phone that's all you need and just you know what i mean just record man just hit that record button it's simple y'all but yeah man we just um ooh, what the hell just happened what the fuck are you chasing the bird i don't I know what's it looked going like on. he was chasing the bird bro uh, he's chasing the bird too you never know what's gonna go down in the hood man you know what i'm saying you don't know what's gonna go down but yeah, we about to head to my homegirl spot, Nene. Oh yeah, I gotta get this spot on here. A and J's, y'all ever in Minnesota? That's the fire hood spot, man. Get y'all some chicken, some catfish. What else they got in there? That sweet Gyro. lemonade, gyro, they, woo! Call Shout out to A and J's, man. This is all free promo. I'm doing all free promo today, man. Y'all in Minnesota, go to A and J's, man. They gonna hook you up. My flame. That's where that food is right there, though. We on the south side. Riding through. About to go get some food. Ride through. About to go get some food. We ride through. 
Ah, uh, this is another thing. I remember wanting a box Caprice over there. That thing was like 1400 I couldn't even get it, man. I wanted it so bad. Oh, you didn't get that red one from there? Nope. I ain't never got no car from there, man. And I used to, back in the day, I was in, it was a little bit before high school. I just thought 1500 was so much money to get. It actually was kind you of know a what lot I mean? It was, then. yeah, it yeah. was, yep. And I was hustling, man. I was out in these streets selling them, selling them dime bags. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> or that tree, tree. You know what I mean? Right. I was a hustler. I was a real hustler back in the day, but I was a petty hustler. I knew how to get it on a very small level, and you know I was just hustling for hey, clothes and stuff, bag though. Used to take you a long way. Man, I was the Nick bag king for real. <laughs> I, I sold Nicks. That's where I was. I was. I was smoking them with the Nicks. Fat Nicks, <laughs> right? All through up and down Lake Street. This is all that got burned down from the riots and stuff. But this was the whole like bars and stuff right there. We used to be out there shooting dice with the old heads. Uh, P, uh, George Floyd. Yeah, rest in peace, George Floyd. You know he. Uh, uh, George Floyd. A couple blocks down there. That's Chicago. That's it's actually five blocks from there. Mm -hmm. So um, yeah, rest in peace, George Floyd. But yeah, this is um, yep, this is where the food is. Midtown Global. Midtown Global on Chicago and Lake, y'all. Hey, this used to be an old, um, matter of fact. It's the Sears, the Sears building, yeah. Sears. Yep, it's the we, Sears we building back in the day. Little. Yep, Chicago Lake liquor stores, man. I grabbed it. plenty of bottles of hand off from them. <laughs> they turned yep. up the global. Global market. Global market and, like, what they call these condos in here, too? Yep, they got condos. I used to stay in there, too. I stayed in there for, like, three years. Where? I stayed in these, yeah. Oh. Remember me and my, my ex? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. I yeah. stayed in there, I man. I about that. I was in there for some years. How do you park your there? I forgot. You got to park back over there. Cut. Yeah, but this is, um, yep, this is where the food is. And it's dope. It got all types of food restaurants in there. Yeah, let's get it. Popo over there plotting on me. What y'all doing? Like, it's closer. That's what I said. What y'all doing? Yep, you park right over there. Mm hmm. Yep, pull in, pull in, pull in, pull in. There we go. And we on our way to the food. Doop. It's a spot right here, y'all. Here we go. The kitchen. Baked by brand. This is where you're going to get it at, y'all. I've been thinking about this bowl all day. Whew. That's exactly how I look, too. Ooh-wee. Stuffed turkey leg. Ooh-wee. Let's get straight to the business. We're going to get straight to the business. What's going on, brother? Mm-hmm. The pack is here, brother. The pack is here. <laughs> this is what I came for. You know how they do shoe reveals? Well, I'm going to do y'all the, the food reveal. It's called the Butter Bowl by Big Brand. Woo-wee. Now, let me, let me show y'all. This is what we came for. This is what we've been waiting on today. You see that, y'all? Y'all see that? You see that sauce on there? This is the, the famous butter bowl sauce. <laughs> Let me show y'all what a bite look like. Man. This is love at first sight, y'all. Mmm. 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 Try that, kid. Try that. You haven't had this? Today your first day. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. How the foodies do, Keith Lee? I stopped here. It was about 10 out of 10. It was a great bowl. The flavor, <laughs> the mac and cheese. Everything was smacking. Everything was smacking just like I expected. The butter bowl, y'all. Mm. Mm. The salt was perfect. Everything about it. Well cooked. Everything about it was 10. 10 out of 10, y'all. Butter bowls, man. So tell me one thing. Was it smacking? That butter bowl? Mm-hmm. That's a 10 out of 10. Something fair. Something serious, y'all. Now I got snacks and stuff. I'm like a little ass kid, man. I stay with some snacks. You feel me? Just got done smashing that fire food. But yeah, man, um, we just chopping it up, man, talking about getting to it and um, you know, just uh, uh being consistent with posting this content, man. That was you know the way I got all my followers 
uh, was just being consistent, man, and, and, and year after year just posting. And um, to a point now where I'm posting way more than I used to, but, you know, it, it's hard sometimes. Sometimes you you uh, you just, you just don't have any motivation to do the videos. You don't have any ideas, but sometimes you just need to go. You just need to turn that camera on and go. And if it comes to time, man, I've been re I was reading this book called The 5 a.m. Club. I, I recommend that to anybody out there. But it talks about getting up earlier, man. Just when you get up 5 a.m., just imagine that 10 a.m. That means you did, that's five hours. I be getting up at 10 a.m. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes, but that's five hours. If you get up at five in the morning, you telling me you got five more hours? You know how much stuff you can do in five hours? How much content you can knock out? Facts. How much everything, bro? And then I put it like this. A lot of people go to jobs, and not to knock a job, but nine to five. You go and put in nine, eight hours into your job, but you won't even put an hour into your own job. You know what I'm saying? Imagine if you just put the hour into shooting a video and editing, and you, you'll be done in an hour. You know what I'm saying? These videos is, is, is shot and edited within an hour, for sure. The long videos I got. But, yeah, I say that to just say, you know what I'm saying, put more, more work into yourself opposed to... You know what I'm saying? Putting more work into everything else. Because at the end of the day, man, you know, everybody, everybody, everybody got a chance to get it, man. With this technology and this free internet, man, and free promo, this is a free, it's a free way to get some money, man. All you got to do is just get to it and start posting. But yeah, man, me and my boy Gooch Bo, he about to blow up his channel, about to blow up. Hey, man, I got to grind it out, man. Yep, it's a, it's an everyday thing. I ain't gonna lie to you, I've been a little distracted. Mm-hmm. Um, sometimes it's gonna happen, man. But it's a part of the game. You gotta you gotta get all the way focused, man. Even gotta, it is. You gotta, sometimes you gotta stop partying. Sometimes mm -hmm. you gotta stop just doing all the little all the little distractions, beats, yeah. Saying, distractions. Stay away from them distractions, man. Yeah, so yep. that's how you gonna get it, man. Look. It, it's 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 not easy as you think, but like he said, you gotta put in the work. Yeah. Once you put in the work, you gonna get the results going to come. Yeah, man. the results going to come. You might feel uncomfortable at first. Yeah. Like when I first started YouTube, yeah. I was uncomfortable with a camera. I'm, I'm not used to, you know, I wasn't used to no cameras. Yeah. Though. I didn't know how to edit. I didn't know how to do yep. thumbnails. Now I know how, I ain't say I'm a perfection, but you know. But you're getting but, better, right? You know what I'm saying? I'm decent. You and, know what I'm saying? And my thing is, it's not about perfection. It's all about progression. Yeah, you going to get, everybody starts at zero. Remember that. Everybody starts at zero followers. And everybody, I didn't know I was terrible at editing but you know what i did i got on youtube and figured out what what editing apps now i use CapCut. i love CapCut. it's super easy for me to edit you don't edit with CapCut, but you know what i mean it has everything there i could do the text there i can do the um animations there yeah, they got but but that's the thing though you learn you you way better than when you did your first video right oh hell yeah exactly and just imagine the more and more you learn the more and more you go the better and better you're gonna get the more subscribers all that good stuff you just gotta go man so I'm just going to say that, man. If y'all out there and y'all y'all thinking about starting a channel or y'all thinking about starting a business, whatever, man, just do it. You're going to learn as you go on, man. Everything ain't going to be perfect. Everything ain't going to go the way you, it's planned. But I know what's going to happen. If you don't do nothing, nothing's going to happen. I can tell you that. But, uh, yeah, man, I'm signing out, man. Make sure y'all subscribe to Boss Man D. We coming at y'all with more videos, too. This was just a, you know what I mean, a quick one, but... We got more stuff coming, yes, so y'all just stay tuned. You know what I'm saying? My boy in the car, so y'all gonna see a lot of car content with him. Yes, sir. You yes, know what I mean? We gonna, we gonna do it all, you man. Know you know. Yeah. But I'm signing out, man. Make sure y'all like, share, subscribe. Subscribe to my boy Boss Man D, and we out of here, man. Peace.